Can you shut your mouth? If you talk, I'm going. Three minutes. Can you give me three minutes? Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. I, we only need six minutes. Look, if you say Jesus is God, listen to me. Jesus is fully God, fully man on the earth. Came on, on the earth. Fully God, fully man. Fully God, fully man is not the Bible. There is not a single verse in the Bible where Jesus is said he is God. Where he said what should be. But the God of the Old Testament, the God of Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, the God of all the prophets, made it clear he is one God. He is the Savior. This is incredible. That he said inconsistency between the New Testament and the Old Testament. Okay? All the prophets in the Bible, they are all Muslims. They all submit their, their will to Almighty God, only one God. Let me call back because they go to they, they don't go to the Old Testament. Go to the Old Testament. In Isaiah 43, 43 10 to 11. Isaiah 43 10 to 11. God said, Yeah, before me no God was so. No shall there be any after me. I am the Lord besides me, there is no Savior. Emphatic. And in your Bible, in Exodus, Exodus, in Exodus 20, 3 to 5. Exodus 20, 20, 3 to 5. You shall have no other gods besides me. You shall not make for yourself a graven image or any likeness of anything that is in heaven above or that is in the earth beneath or that is in the water of the earth. You shall not bow down to them or serve them, for I, the Lord your God, am a jealous God. Same as you repeated in the book of Deuteronomy, chapter number 5, 7 to 9. You shall have no other gods besides me. You shall not make for yourself a graven image or any likeness of anything that is in heaven above or that is in, that is in the earth beneath. Or that is in the water on the earth. You shall not bow down to them or serve them, for I, the Lord your God, am a jealous God. God made it emphatic that they should, you should not worship anything, anybody except Him. In the book of uh, 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 Exodus, Exodus 34 14, God said, And do not worship any other God. For the Lord, whose name is Jealous, is a jealous God, Old Testament. Now, John 17 3, this will be declared. There's only one God. Amen. And this is eternal no, okay. and this is eternal life that they may know that you are the only true yeah, God and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent, emphatic, who sent Jesus, the Almighty God. Jesus said he, he had a God, he was a God. John 20, 17. Jesus said to make Mary Magdalene, touch me not, for I am not yet ascended to the Father. Mm -hmm. But go to my brethren and said to them, I am ascending to your father and your father, to my God and your God. Who is John 8:42? John 8 42, Jesus said, If God were your father, you would love me. For I have come here from God. I have not come on my own. God sent me. Who sent Jesus? Who is that God? God, show me. Who sent Jesus? Jesus said, Yeah, if God were your father, you would love me. For I, I have come here from God. I have not come on my own. God sent me. Who is that God? The Father is God, and the Son is God. How many gods are there? Let me open it. Any angle you come from, I debunk it. Three minutes, three minutes now, and I'm not, I'm not going to disturb you. You have three minutes. Prove to me that Jesus is God. I won't say anything. When it finishes, I'll talk. Go on. No interruption. I'm waiting for you. Prove to us that Jesus is God. Am I ready? And don't ask me any questions. Go. Just prove it. Oh, may I start? Okay. He said, prove to him that Jesus is God. All right? In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Right? He called himself the Alpha and the Omega. The beginning and the end. Yeah, okay? and, the, and the middle. Don't forget the middle. Okay, again. In the beginning, God alone. So much time, three minutes, time, 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 so much time. Got it, time. So that, so yeah, three minutes. Respect of debate. You know, I'm not gonna waste time to talk over you. Three minutes. I'm gonna give you Bible lessons. Yeah, come on. Come on. I wait. Got it. In the beginning, God is the only one that calls Himself the Alpha and the Omega. Right? No one alone. No other prophet has ever called themselves the Alpha and the Omega. Is that true? Why is Jesus himself here saying, I am the Alpha, I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last. What you see written in this book, send it to the seven churches, which are in Asia, to the emphasis, scenario, and Pergamos. To, you, you get what I'm saying? Okay, here, in Isaiah 53, in Isaiah 53, all right? Let's go to Isaiah 53. In Isaiah 53, 
where he talks about you should bear a son. Actually, I'll go to John instead for now. In John 14, I'm being very calm, guys, because y'all don't want to say I'm interrupting or anything like that. Right? In John 14, he says, prove to him that he is that Jesus is God. Right? In John 14, Philip asks Jesus, show him the Father so that he can believe in him. Revelation 22, 30. I, yep, I'll get there. I'll get there. John 14. And it says here. Uh, it says here. All right. It says, let not your hearts be troubled. You believe in God. Believe also in me. Who's talking there? This is Jesus talking here. This is Jesus talking here. He says, let, your, let not your hearts be troubled. You believe in God, also believe in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would not have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare the place for you, I will come again and receive you to myself. Amen. Thank you. And when, and, and, and where I am, and where I am, there you will also be. And where I go, where I, where I go, you know, you know, and you may know. Okay? And then Thomas says, Lord. This is why I don't like about the whole time. Let me finish it. Don't finish it. Let me finish it. Yeah. Okay, I'll finish this last part. I'll finish, finish, finish the last part. Finish all of it. So here, here, one of the disciples asks Jesus, who follows Jesus, says, show me God so I can believe in you. That's what the disciple says to him. Show me God so I can believe in you. And this is what Jesus says to him. Um, oh, Philip, uh, Jesus says to him, have I not been with you for so long and yet you have not known me, Philip? He who has seen me has seen the Father. I just proved to you that Jesus is God. He said to himself in his own words. You finish. You finish. Let me talk. I just told you, you come anywhere from the Bible. I, I just did. No, no, I'm going to give Bible lessons. I know that bus. I don't have to open it. Let me talk. My three minutes. Yeah, he's calling from control of joy. Wait, 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 wait. No, wait, let wait, me wait. talk. Stop, stop, stop. You tell you already. Stop. There's a lot of evidence stop. there. But I'm ready stop. to talk. Stop. Wait a second. Besides John, I also read Revelation. Okay, I, I'm quite, I am the Alpha I, and the Omega. I know all that. The book that as well. I know. I'll do. Yeah, okay, okay. give me. Yeah. So he's quoting from any angle you come from. Any angle. <laughs> it's coming from John, John 14, uh, 1 to 9. Yeah. yeah. From verse number 1, Jesus himself makes a distinction between Almighty God. Verse number 1 said, let not your husband trouble. Believe in God, believe also in me. In me. Oh, no, let no, me finish. No. Yeah. Who is that God Jesus pointed And who is he? No, let me finish. No, no, bro. Oh, no. Let me again, man. Who is he? The Messiah? The prophet? He never said, he said, believe it. He never said, you know, let me talk. See, that's that's a I, just, I gave you extra time in fact. Even to talk. Let me see yeah. I'm not interrupting. Yeah. From verse number one, he said, disciples were there. He was talking to the disciples. He said, let not your heart be, let not your heart be troubled. You disciples, believe in God, believe also in me. Me means the, the Messiah. The, the Messiah. Not God incarnate. If this was God, he would have said, let not your heart be troubled. Believe in God, believe also in God the Son. Or the second part of Trinity, God the Son, but he didn't say that. And the next part, verse number two said, In my father's house, there are many mountains. Whose, whose house? And then you're going to, they always call this uh, the last one, verse number nine, John 14 9. Jesus saw the Philips. He did not see me, has seen the Father. How can he say so the Father? For them, Christians who are ignorant of the Bible say, Yeah, Jesus is the Father on earth, fully. Man, it means you have read your Bible because if you read the Bible, in the, let me finish. In the gospel, let's start again. Start it. Come, let me come, come, please. Like, I said I'm going to go. If you start it. In the gospel of Matthew, gospel of Matthew, chapter number twenty-three, verse number nine, Jesus said, "And do not call anyone on the earth Father, for you have one Father, and He's in heaven. heaven." And when Jesus said this, He was on the earth. So Jesus, Jesus was not in the Father when he was on the earth. Follow in the Bible, in the Gospel of John, John 5, 37, Jesus said, yeah, and the Father who sent me has himself borne witness to me. His voice you have never heard, his form you have never seen. So why do they, why do the ignorant preachers here go to John 14 and say that when uh, Jesus said to Philip, 
he that he that has seen me has seen the Father, which means that Jesus is Lord. Fully God, fully man, Father on the earth. You are blaspheming. Okay, can I read this? Yes, yes, no, no, so no, let me no, let no, finish. Let me finish. Thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. I'm gonna go. Then I'm gonna go to Revelation and the Revelation. You want me to do back and revelation? I'm an here. I'm gonna go. Any, I'm gonna come from. God, 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 God give it to you. Let's finish. Jesus saying to Philip, He that has seen me has seen the Father. Me, I am the Father's representative. I am the Messiah. You cannot see the Father. Anything you want to know about the Father, about God, come and ask me. Because I'm the Messiah. That's what it means. Go. Okay. Three minutes. Go. John 17. John 17. I'm going to read what it says, okay? I'm going to read what it says. This is Jesus who prays for. Listen very closely, please. He who has an ear, let him hear. You are, clearly. Watch this. I'm going to read what it says. I'm waiting. I'm going to read what it says, okay? Jesus prays for himself. Jesus spoke these words and lifted up his eyes to heaven and said, Father, the hour has come. Glorify your son that your son also may glorify you as you have given him authority over all flesh and he shall give eternal life. Who's given eternal life? Eternal life to as many as you have given him. And this is eternal life. Listen closely. And this is eternal life that they may know you the only true God and Jesus Christ. Yeah. Whom, you uh, uh, Whom you have sent. Why are they missing? Why can't the you finish it? Finish Whom it. you have sent. Whom you have sent. But you're missing the point. No, but finish it. it. <laughs> you're still missing the point. No, okay, three minutes. So is Jesus? He, he's not finishing. Okay, it. I'll finish the whole thing. And when I finish the whole thing, the question I'm going to ask him was Jesus with God in the beginning. Don't worry. Finish okay, it. let me finish it. Let me finish. The question I asked him was Jesus with God in the beginning. But watch him. He can't answer it. And, and this is eternal life, that they may know you, the only true God, and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. Oh. I have I have glorified you on earth. I have finished the work which you have given me to do. And now, O oh Father, glorify me together with yourself, with the glory which I had with you before the world was. So was God, or was Jesus with God in the beginning? Yes or no? And watch, he can't even answer it. He's going to jump to something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can't answer it. He won't answer it. You got 30 seconds left before you want to I know, and I need him to answer it. Okay. Look, he said Jesus was with God in the beginning. Answer what I just no, asked no, him. Let, let, I'm talking, I'm talking. Okay. Yeah. You see, I said, that's not a fair debate. Let me finish. I asked you a question, I said, no, and you no, won't no, give me an answer. Okay. You were jumping to something else. I'm talking. That's what a coward no. do. It's your Bible, I've got your Bible. Okay, explain to me Jesus, why Jesus said, Jesus was Jesus with God in the beginning? No. Why? You hear that? Yeah. No. So clearly he can't. I'll, I'll read it what, again. I'll tell you what, let me talk. With let me the talk. glory I have with let, you let me in talk. the beginning. Let me talk I'll now. read it again. I know. Time you, know why? Time you, know why? you 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 know why? That is why he said your Bible is contradictory. Wait, let me talk. You why it's contradictory? New Testament, I said. Jesus said, right, let's go to glorify me. Let me talk. Yes, glorify sir. me glorify me with the glory I had with you before the world began. This is John 17, 5. In the New Testament, look at what God said in the Old Testament. Yeah, in Deuteronomy, in Deuteronomy, in, 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 in Deuteronomy 32, 39. Listen to this. Deuteronomy 32, 39. Now, see that I, even I am he, and there is no God with me. Is there any God with God? According, according to God. There is no God with me. God made it clear. clear. See now that I, even I am he, there is no God with me. Uh -huh. I kill and I make life. Uh -huh. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hands. Uh -huh. So if Jesus was with God in the beginning, was Jesus God in the beginning? Mm, yes. Yeah. So Jesus was with God in the beginning. Yes. And Jesus said. was God. That's what he said. So how many gods are there? There's only one God. No, uh, you're lying. Uh, don't it make sense. Lying Jesus was with God. You can't hear it. Uh, uh, you really can't see it. So let me ask you this. We can see. Let me ask you this. Hold on, hold on. Does God have a spirit? Let me. Does God have a spirit? Let me. Let me. Does God have a spirit? Does God have a spirit? I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. That's what Allah, Allah, Allah in the Quran make it clear in Surah Muminun. He brings spirit into man. Let me finish. In Surah Muminun, 32, 32, 91. Yeah, this verse, yeah, the banks, John 3:16 and John 1:1. John 3:16, 1, 
said, he said, for God's sake, let me finish. For, it's my turn. I'm not going to finish. Let me finish. Whoever believes in him will not perish and have eternal let life. Let, let me finish. Let me finish. Yeah. Yeah. He quoted John 3 16. For God so loved his world. For God so loved the world. Let me finish. I'm gonna go. You're not even quoting it right. Let me finish. No, that's a problem, bro. It's but I know you're about to decide. I'm, I'm finish, quoting. Bro. I'm not quoting right. That's why no one wants to debate with you. Give you Bible lessons. Listen to me. I don't have to open. You're opening it. I don't need to open it. You are opening it. I'm reading it. If I ask you, you can close it. Go, go, go. One more. Go three. Go three. Trust in the Lord with all that heart. Lean not into that own understanding. Let me In all your ways, acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your path. Proverbs three and five. I'm gonna go. Let me talk. Come on. You just ask me close up. You what happened? Let me talk. Let me talk. It's my the fear of the Lord is my strength. Are you scared? I'm gonna go. I'm two minutes now. Interrupting. Okay. I was in two minutes. I'm gonna go. Allah, time. Allah made a claim. It's there. It's Surah Muminun, 2391. Allah said, yeah, yeah. These verses, as I said, one verse kills two birds, two birds of one stone. John 3 16. For God so loved the world he that He gave His only begotten Son. Now who said, who saw me believe in Him? Some have perished, but I have a life. Let me finish. And John 1 1. In the beginning was the word, the and the word was. God. How rude you are, man. That's why no one wants to be with you. Brothers, I'm going to go to a conclusion here. I'm going to go in the Quran. I said, hey, you are a coward because you are scared. You are interrupting me. But three minutes, Allah made in the Quran, Surah Al Muminun, chapter number 23. Allah said, Allah has not become your son. No has there ever been with any God, any deity in the beginning. with him in the beginning. In if the there had been oh, really? the deity would have taken Genesis what he created. And some of them would have sought to overcome others. Glorified is Allah above that they attribute to him. So I'm going to go back out now. This God, in the beginning. Is, you can see, it's a waste of time. The spirit of God was hurting over Stop it, with this crap trap. This is inept. All your Muslims are cowards. All your Muslims are cowards.